I've already told you the story of Alexander the Great. How many of you have not heard it? Raise your hands. Look at that. <laughs> Can't be. All right. So I'll tell you the story of Alexander. <laughs> You're very clever, I know. <laughs> All right. So, the story of Alexander is like this, that Alexander the Great invaded India, you know, much before Buddha was born, or we can say, no, uh, we can say after Buddha was born. And he went with the idea of conquering the whole of India. He was a very powerful man. But God did, did not want that perhaps, so he was once defeated and one king called Puru arrested him. Alexander had married an Indian lady and when he was under the arrest of this king, that was the day of this Raksha Bandhan, the same day. So she was a clever lady, she put one thread like this in a small little plate and covered it nicely with some nice cloth and sent it to the king Puru in his court. When he took it to the court, uh, somebody, and gave it to him, he had to wear it because that was the day of Raksha Bandhan and that day anybody who sends you this thread, is, you become the brother. So then he asked, who is my sister? So they said, she is the wife of Alexander. And he got really upset with it because a sister's husband is something very great in India. So he rushed to the jail and he fell straight on his knees and begged of his pardon. He said, I'm sorry, sir, I didn't know you were the husband of my sister. He said, what? Yeah, you are. And I'm sorry, I'm very sorry for this thing that I have changed you this way and put you here in, and behind the bars. This was very wrong on my part. And he was so apologetic that Alexander could not understand the whole thing. Not only that, he brought him back and put him on the throne his own throne, and he said, now you rule here, I cannot say anything. Now you have become the real king and I have to become sort of your subject. So Alexander started looking at him. He said, I, I can't understand this. So then he went to his house, then he went to his house with uh, so many things that the king had given him. He gave jewellery, he gave saris, clothes for him and all kinds of things, plus horses and elephants. And then when he reached home, he found that his wife was smiling behind the doors. He said, what's the matter? He said, don't you understand? He said, no, I don't understand, these Indians are funny people. <laughs> I mean, I'm a, such a dangerous man, he had put me in the jail and now he has released me. I just can't understand these Indians. How can this happen to a person who is so dangerous? So then she smiled and she said, see, today is the day of Raksha Bandha and this is the thread I sent him. And because this thread was tied to him, he became my brother and he had to release you because you are my brother. He was so frightened he said, that settles it, I'm going home. <laughs> because with these Indians who can leave a prisoner only on a thread, you can't manage these people, are very difficult, he could not understand.